What's up, guys? Working out of Taco here. Day 43 of P90X round 5. Chest, shoulders, and triceps, and a rough day. Um, I got less than four hours of sleep, and uh, work was so so. I'm just kind of exhausted. I just finished 15,000 steps. Um, not too long ago. It's late. Uh, if I'm lucky, I might be able to get five hours of sleep tonight. Mm, it'd be nice. Um, this was probably one of the longest, if it wasn't the longest P90X exercise session. From getting less than four hours of sleep, even with um, uh, protein preloading and having 400 milligrams of caffeine, I had to take frequent breaks the plus side of all this is everything has gone up uh, for reps and or weights um, I took extended not really extended just a couple minute breaks between almost every exercise uh, and a lot of the numbers are exceeding uh, my peak numbers from when I was in better health which is great and um, some of the exercises um, where I was close to uh, the 15 rep count, I said, screw it, let's just up the weight. Uh, a lot of numbers improving, a lot of changes, a lot of a lot of better. But uh, it took me over two hours to do the whole program. It wasn't a matter of um, being lazy. It was just it was a, it was a fatigue. Uh, and it got to a point where I started to get a little bit of nausea and I wound up consuming a lot of water. Took a little break. Uh, turned the fan on, blowing me for a couple minutes. Got back into it. Uh, overall, I'm proud and very happy with the numbers as far as how much of the increase. I'm really enjoying this uh, taking longer breaks because instead of me doing it the old fashioned way, it's, it's me adapting, evolving, and changing the way I do the program. Instead of just going through it and keeping the heart rate up and getting that calorie burn, I'm letting myself calm down, recoup to get some of my strength back for the next exercise, and as a result, able to perform above and beyond just adding one rep or doing one more push-up or pull-up, etc., whatever the program is. Um, so it's taken, I believe this is uh, technically the eighth round of P90X, and, uh, you know, I, I, I'm changing the way I'm doing it. Eight rounds of P90X in a perfect world of not stopping is over 24 months. That's over two years of nonstop. <laughs> of course, it was spread out for me. Um, but, you know, it's, it's an evolution for me and a change because I'm trying to do the best I can with my body at my age and what I can do and evolving it and adapting it there is a limit to how far I want to go and how much shape I want to get into where I particularly would like to eventually switch over to a maintenance mode and maybe if I'm not so satisfied with the results um, increase the intensity a little bit or just wind up doing another round of P90X but uh, that's pretty much it. I'm very tired. I want to try and get, you know, maybe five hours of sleep. If I stretch it out a little bit, I might be able to get a little over five. But uh, I'm trying to hold a yawn in right now. Uh, that's pretty much it. Tomorrow's going to be cardio. Uh, we're going to shoot for 20K steps. Uh, time may honestly be the factor to whether or not I have enough time left over at the end of the day, work day, to come home and get my steps, but I will try my best. This is working out of Taku, if your day's not going great, I hope it's better for you. If your day's going great, I get even better. Little quick tip of advice, try to get more than four hours of sleep, because um, sometimes, um, without going ridiculously over, a uh, reasonable amount of caffeine sometimes just doesn't help give you that push that you need to get through your exercise. We'll see you guys next time.